So in this video, we're discussing the T-square probability table. So given that we've got a degree of freedom of 5 and a T-square value of 16, we want to find the P-value. So we start with a degree of freedom, and we find the degree of freedom on the left-hand column, and we then isolate that entire row, in this case 5. So once we've got this, we can now look at our T-square value, which is 16. Um, so we'll see that we've got a 15.09 and we've got a 16.75, but the 16 is between those two, and that's then how we find our probability. So um, the p-value is going to be between 0 0.05 and 0 0.01. So let's look at another example. In this case, we've got a degree of freedom of 3 and a t-square value of 6. So once again, we start with a degree of freedom and we isolate that row, in this case 3. Next, we look at our t-square value. So we're going to try and find the 6. So here we see we've got a 4.64 and we've got a 6.25. So our t-square value is somewhere in between. And therefore, we can say that our p-value is going to be between 0 0.1 and 0 0.2. 